Hello everyone, I'm Chin, and you can call me Ken. Welcome back to Chrono Engine ABA Small Tutorial, and this time this is an extra tutorial. Someone has asked me if I can change the item through pressing some items. So I've made this tutorial, and today I've used some extra blocking and this time I'm using Yen Flight's blocking and you can use picture command or you can use button common event and it's just up to you and I'll show you both so first I'll just use the picture common event and inside picture common event that means you can choose a picture and then show something through the common event so first at the beginning I just create a picture I just create a picture and then name the picture give it a number and it's number one this number is really important because this is the ID of these pictures and I just put it in the upper left and after that you got a picture and the picture ID is 1 then you can go to your plugin manager and check out your picture command event and in here you can see there's a lot of picture 1's, picture 2's, picture 3's and etc and we're using picture 1 and inside picture 1 there will be four choices I usually use click that means when you click on the pictures and you run something and this one is your common event so when you click on the picture one you run common event one now let's check out what is common event one now this is my common event one I name it change item and every time when I call this common event I just add one to a variable and the variable I just name it item then after that you detect if item one equal to one if item variable one equal to two if item variable one equal to three and at the first time I I just use the default so that means item is zero and when the first time I click on the pictures you add one to this variable so it comes to here and inside here I run the plugin command so I'll set the actors ID to the item one and give this item one to player ID one and also I show you something some text this is the item sword then next time when I click on the pictures then you'll show this cause now the item variable is now 2 so you run this one and I'll set actor item to item 3 and give it to actor 1 and your show tags it's item bomb then next time I click on the pictures you add one to the item variable and you'll become three so you'll run the plugin command inside here and give the item four to actor one and you'll say this is item hookshot and inside here I'll make the item variable back to zero so next time when you click on the pictures you add one and zero plus one it will become one so you start from here again and now I'll just let you see the items item one three and four okay as you can see item one is sword item three is bomb and item four is hookshot now let's get into the game and let's check out
Okay, as you can see, now there's nothing inside the item. And when I click on this, the picture I just use, I click on it and you'll say item sword. And I got some items. And of course I can use it. Of course I can use this sword. And when I click on this again, you'll say item bomb. And as you can see, it become item bomb. And I can use item bomb. And next time, if I click on the items, it will say item hookshot. And I can use the hookshot. So every time you hit the items, you'll change your item. <laughs> and that's for picture common event. Now let's go check out bottom common event. Well, they are almost the same, but you just change the picture into a bottom. Now let's take a look inside. Inside here, there will be a lot of key, and the key just your keyboard. And now I'll just show you key one. That means the bottom one on your keyboard. And here, it's just the same like picture common event. That means which common event you will run when you press your key one. So I just use the same common event, I use one. And now let's just check out what is. Okay, this time I don't click on the item, I just simply press one. And you show this, and of course I can use the sword. Of course I can use the sword. And the next time I press one, you say it's bomb and I just put bombs over here and then it explode I just put bomb <coughs> and next time I press one and it become a hook shot and I can use the hook shot and that's all for this tutorials and if you like it Please thumbs up or subscribe. Thank you very much.